we have gathered to talk about service area. And service area involves uh, three dimensional figures. Yeah. So what did I sketch here? I've sketched um, a cube, yeah, which if, if you like is a three dimensional square. Yeah. So all those sides are equal in length. Yeah. They are all five centimeters. Okay, so that is a cube. Okay. Now what is surface area? Can we just think for a few seconds uh, about that word, surface area? Uh, what do you notice there? Well, first of all, it talks about area, yeah, which is, if you like, the amount of space it covers. Yeah? And that is always two-dimensional, it's flat. And the other part of surface area is the word surface. So it is the area at the surface, if you like, of your three-dimensional figure. So it is the area, for instance, on this side of the dice, yeah, if this would be a dice, it is the area on that side, it is the area on that side, and if you would turn it around, it will be the area on the back side, on the bottom, and on the left side. Okay, so I'm not interested at, uh, I'm not interested in the inside of my, of my cube, I'm not interested in the volume, I'm interested in the area which lies at the surface. That is what surface area is. All right, so all I have to do is to find the area of each individual face. Yeah, now for a cube, all faces are the same. All six sides have an equal area. Okay, so let's find the area of one of them. Yeah, that is five times five. Five times five, which is 25. Okay, now I could do that six times, yeah, because here it's also five times five, which is 25. And on the back side, it's also five times five, which is 25. And on top, it's also five times, it's 25. Yeah, a cube, they're all the same. How many faces does it have? Well, it has six, eh? So the area of one of them times six is gonna give me the total surface area, yeah? 25 times six, that is 150, and the unit is a centimeter squared. All right, so surface area is the area at the surface. So in this case, I could find the area of one face, yeah, of one side, and times it by six. Why? Because they are all the same, yeah? The top and the bottom are the same, the sides are the same, yeah? Back and forth, they're all the same, they all have the same area, yeah? But for any other um, uh, three-dimensional figure, if I would just find the area of each individual face, and I plus them at the end, that will also give me my surface area. Okay, I have more examples for you, go to the next video.